Why I chose stocks as assets? Well, you gotta know at first. Uh, stocks definitely just wasn't something I was looking into at all. Like I thought you had to have, you had to be either really smart or you need to have tens of thousands of dollars and really know numbers well and just definitely not something on my radar at all. But then I heard the word cash flow for stocks. I Meaning you could generate income every month off a of stock. So that piqued my interest. So I looked into it a little bit more, started studying, uh, bought a course, dug in, and ugh, it, it just seemed too complex, way too overwhelming, and then basically I kind of kind of backed off for a little bit. That was until, until a few days later when I came across a podcast called Trading Stocks Made Easy with Tyrone Jackson. Trading stocks made easy. I thought, well, I don't want it to be hard. So I started to listen. And it wasn't too long listening when I soon figured out this was the guy. He was explaining stuff in a Sesame Street type of version that I could understand. And with no BS, it wasn't about getting rich quick stuff. It was about slowly building wealth. It was a little slower but with lower risk. And with 20 years experience, lots of credibility, and a free podcast to start learning from, and I could get into the game of investing for less than 500 bucks. Well, actually, if you set up an account, you can do it for $100, you could start investing. Anyway, while I was building up the account, I could practice as well. And these are just a few of the things that got me excited about stocks. I know, it's starting to sound like a commercial, but those are a few reasons, and there's a few more too. The fact that I can buy a stock, and it'll pay me, as it's growing over the years, it'll pay me in the form of a dividend every three months. Yeah, I, I like that. That sounds okay. Works for me. And then there's trading. Cover calls in particular, one type of trade, where you can go buy shares of a company, and someone's going to pay you for the option to buy those shares away from you at the end of the month, or whatever date you want to set, but at the end of the month usually, at a higher price than what you paid for them. And if they don't take them, you still keep the money, and you get to do it the next month, giving you monthly income off your money. For me, the biggest part, the fact I could learn all this, and do all this from off a laptop, and actually, you can do it off your phone. And I've been doing about 90% of it off my phone. Eh, maybe 95. But anyway, that was another big, huge thing. You can take it anywhere you want to go. You can do it anywhere. I like that part too. These are, just, these are the reasons why I chose stocks as assets. As an asset. As an asset. As an asset.